Spring Lake Park hoping, hoping that they can hope in their way to some playoff mm -hmm. positioning as well in 5A. A big game, taking on a pretty hot Coon Rapids Cardinals team that had won their first three, then lost the game. Panthers trying to snap a two-game losing streak. And what do you do? Late in the first, you give it to Derek Bergman. Do it. Derek Bergman scores his seventh touchdown of the season, rushing it in from three yards out. Panthers take the lead. More running. Still in the first, by the way. All happening in the first. This time, fake it to Bergman, the keeper for Zach Dunbar. He goes around the left end. And an extra point makes it 14-0 Panthers. We're still not done in the first quarter. Oh, my. Redbirds with the football. They want to get on the board. Little play action fake. Razzle dazzle wide open. And bang, Jake Van Holzen goes 55 yards to Avant Shannon. He was wide open. That's why they're fired up, bouncing up and down in red, watching their Cardinals get on the board. Good little play fake. Shannon never stopped running. And right there for him to pick it up, scoop, score on his way to the end zone. 14-7 after one late in the second. Cardinals all the way back they come. And yeah, ooh -hoo indeed. Miles Taylor full back up front pushing. He finishes with some authority and tells everybody, this is where we play. This is our field. This is our grass. This is our stadium. We're the Cardinals. 14 all into the fourth, a scoreless third. Panthers back to the ground. Hole burst wide open. Brian Aurelio Lopez, that's all he has to do. Oriana Lopez, excuse Fiolo. me. That's all he's got to do. Max Horn, the right tackle, senior center, Sam Britz. Look at Max Horn, just walking around trying to find somebody to block. <laughs> that hole is wide open. Eric Amundsen on the right guard spot also. Some credit for that. That's the last score the Panthers would need. 21-14, last ditch effort. Van Hole's in, a little bit too high. Off the hands, incomplete on a fourth down and short with less than three and a half minutes to go. Panthers win. Thanks to CTN for that. Gotta love it. Always love getting the CTN footage. 21 14, the final. Panthers now, again, that's big to get it back over 500. They lost two straight after picking up a couple of wins. Close one, of course, a couple weeks ago with uh, Robin Dale Cooper. Yeah, and Hopkins. And Hopkins at before, after that. And now they're back to three and two. So you see Zach Dunbar both on the ground, and he did complete a pass for 12 yards. Oriana Lopez, 140 in the touchdown. Ooh, Violo! Spreading the scoring around. Sam Fritz, 11 tackles. So a big day all the way around offensively and defensively for the Panthers, who have North St. Paul. The Polars. Polars? Right? <laughs> yeah, I believe you're Polars? saying it correctly. Oh, no, okay, no, I'm no, sorry. No, you were right the first <laughs> the time. The Polars. They're coming to town before you get one at Park Center and then close it out at home the, against Forest Lake. The Pirates. The Pirates. The Rangiers. The Rangiers. Love me a good Rangiers matchup. Robin Stone Cooper still unbeaten at 5-0. and Irondale. Irondale is 4-1 and overall and 2-1. and They are the uh, the team that handed Coon Rapids that first loss, but that was like a two-point game. So Cardinals a little closer there to some gold division teams, but right now still the division.